Hello, in this video we are going to be covering the image object and it's pretty simple. The image object allows you to display an image. So we go right here, so if we just drag and oops, it's easy. We just drag and drop it, you might be wondering what's the difference between an image and a sprite. Uh, there aren't many differences, so let me just drag on a sprite and show you. So with the sprite in the feature section, you got an image resource which you have with the image as well. But also you got some blending modes as well because these are more used for game objects such as players, player, enemy, bullets, background, you know that sort of stuff. And the image is great for more UI related stuff, stuff that really isn't going to be doing much that's just there. And plus you also support the scale 9 grid so if you want to use that that's cool as well. So to actually use an image once it's dragged on you can just scroll down double click the image resource it supports PNG and JPEG just like a sprite does and just open up an image if it's not included it will import it so let's resize this image <laughs> this is an image I created in paint yesterday and if I were to run this it displays my image like so so it's that simple to display an image so if you're just doing stuff or just putting stuff on the screen that generally you're not going to be changing not going to be interacting with they're just, they're just there especially when they're part of the hood and uh, the image object is a good thing to use we are going to show you the code of how to implement image into your project because you don't do that in coca studio you do that within your coca 2dx or coca 2d js project but don't worry we've got a coca api guide and there'll be a link in the description to the page that shows you how to implement and actually access the image using code so check that out and as usual thank you for watching and i hope you have a great day